It's the semantic. You find crochet tutorials. It's the semantic. For your favorite superheroes. It's the semantic. Make your awesome car and home decor. It's the semantic. American English doesn't have to be a bore. It's the semantic. For semantics and antics and more. It's the semantics. Hi guys, it's Samantha Goodhart with thesemantics.com, thesemantics.etsy.com, and cafepress.com slash thesemantics. Thank you for joining me for part four of my updated version on how to crochet the Batman symbol. In this video, we're going to be working on the bottoms of the wings. And keep in mind that the wings are identical. Now, you will have to watch the video twice, but it shouldn't take more than half an hour. And after you've watched it the second time to make the second one, make sure that you line it up to make sure that they're even because I myself have messed it up numerous times and had to undo it quite a bit. So, thanks for joining me again and enjoy! So now that we've finished the top of the bat, we're going to flip it over and you're going to find where you started your rectangle and attach the yarn there. Now you'll notice that you might have this gap right here that is not the first stitch. The first stitch is actually directly next to it. So if it's easier for you, you can count out from the other side 76 stitches across and then the 76th one will be where you insert the hook. So once you've done that, attach the yarn And then you're going to crochet all the way across 76 times. And make sure that when you do this, if you have any loose strands, that you crochet over them. Now when you've finished that, you can chain once and turn it. And then you're going to single crochet 11 times across. And 
then you're going to combine the next two stitches. If you don't remember how to do that, you insert the hook into the first stitch, grab the yarn and pull it through, insert the hook into the second one, grab the yarn and pull it through that one, yarn over, and then pull through all three loops. And then you can chain once and turn it. And then you're going to combine the first two stitches, single crochet eight times, combine the last two stitches, chain once and turn it. Combine the first two stitches, single crochet seven times, combine the last stitch of this row with the last of the previous row, chain once and turn it. Combine the first two stitches, single crochet six times, combine the last one with the last stitch of the previous row, chain once and turn it. Combine the first two stitches, single crochet six times, chain once and turn it, single crochet six more times, Combine the last one with the last stitch of the previous row, chain once and turn it. Combine the first two stitches, single crochet four times, single crochet twice in the last one, chain once and turn it, single crochet twice in the first one, single crochet five times, combine the last one with the last stitch of the previous row, chain once and turn it, combine the first two stitches, single crochet five times, single crochet twice in the last one, chain once and turn it, single crochet twice in the first one, single crochet six times, Combine the last stitch with that of the previous row, chain once and turn it, combine the first two stitches, single crochet six times,
single crochet twice in the last one. Chain once and turn it. Single crochet twice in the first one. Single crochet six times. Combine the last two stitches of this row, chain once and turn it. Combine the first two stitches, single crochet six times, single crochet twice in the last one, chain once and turn it, single crochet twice in the first stitch, single crochet five times, and then combine the last three stitches of this row. And when you've finished that, you can fasten off. Now you can go back to the beginning of this video to do the other bottom of the wing. Then once you've finished the second one, you can stay tuned for part five, which will be the little triangles at the bottom. And that's basically it. So thank you very much for watching. I hope that you are happy with the way that it's coming out. I myself think that this is a big improvement from the first one that I did, so I really hope that you like it as well. So until next time, take care. F-C-M-A-N-T-I-C-S <laughs> Oh boy. That's fun. <clears throat> Let's see. Let's do that one more time.